This is a little bit of what the process is for me when I select yarn to go with a project. There's yarn in there, which is like yellows, whites. This is like my pinks, purples, and then I have like blues, browns, oranges over there. But this one, this little elephant one with the pink, I have decided that this one, which is like a purple mix with white, is going to be for that one. This one I'm still deciding on if I want to do this one that's got like some greens, yellows, pinks for this whale one. Or this one that has more blues, pinks, yellows type of thing. And then over here with more yarn, um, there's this here. That I'm deciding between this one and the brown for this jungle one there and then this one or sorry on the jungle one this green too it's kind of like a fluorescent green and then this one I'm deciding between the gray or a white with it and then this one here I'm deciding between if I want to do a blue with it, this kind of like dark blue, or after some digging, I found this one that is like a bluey orange white color mix. So I might go with that one. I kind of am leaning more towards that one, but I don't know. I am still, still debating. So, but this is my thought process. And I have to leave things out to see what I like and what I don't like. But I'm going to let me sneak out here. Oh, okay. It's not so fast, but here is what today's been like. This is more yellow in the camera, but it is more pink in person. This, I was just out here a little bit ago, and right along the top, it was a kind of like, a, like a purple type mountain that was coming out of the cloud. So I didn't get to get a picture quick enough. And then it was just yellow along the top of those clouds. But we've had fog. We did get some snow. And I was going to come out and shovel it. It wasn't much. But I was just going to come kind of push it off. And by mid-afternoon to late afternoon, it was already melted. The We've had this wind today. The town next to ours, from what I've heard, they have power lines down. They've had wind gusts up to 65 miles an hour, so it's been pretty blustery today, I guess you can say. Um, this week has been crazy, and I have been gone Monday, and then Tuesday, Wednesday, I was cleaning and straightening and getting things gone through, and then Thursday I was gone. Today was enough, like finishing up the project. And I have a pile that is ready to go to donations, or for donations, I should say. A pile that's ready for donation. And then I have got the bookkeeping partway done today. I'll finish that up tomorrow. And then there's just a few things here and there, cleaning-wise, to finish out the week. And then I'll prepare for primary tomorrow as well. I'm a primary teacher now, so... I will be working on my lesson tomorrow. I'm not teaching the lesson per se, um, just because of COVID, we're all had some changes, things done. Um, so, but I'm looking in on the lesson and seeing what the lesson's about for this week. A little bit more, I've been looking at it throughout the week, but I'm going to look a little bit more in depth tomorrow and get a handout ready. I'm going to also get my 
primary bag prepped and ready to go. So there's just today, or sorry, this week and today. <laughs> this week has been a busy but productive week. I feel accomplished and I feel proud of myself. But I'm going to head in, get dinner, and get warmed up because it is cold. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.